Hello students, in this video we are going to learn about forming four digit number and skip counting. Now students, for forming four digit number you have to keep some points in your mind. First is to form the greatest four digit number you have to arrange the number in descending order or you have to say that you should arrange the digits in descending order. And if you want to form the smallest four digit number then what you will do? You have to arrange the given digits in ascending order. But here you have to remember that if 0 is there in these four digits you have to place 0 at 100 place. Now students, let's see the example here. Here we have to form the greatest 4 digit number and smallest 4 digit number by using the digits 2, 9, 0 and 5. So the greatest 4 digit number will form by arranging the number in descending order. So here the number is 9520. Now let's see when we form the smallest four digit number we will arrange the number in ascending order. So here we are having the smallest four digit number is 2059. Okay, so why we will put 0 at 100 place? Because we cannot put 0 at 1000 place. Because it will count as 3 digit number. So we will put 0 at 100 place. So the smallest 4 digit number is 2059. Now students, our next topic is skip counting. You have already learned skip counting in 2's, 3's, 5's and 10's in the previous class. Now let's learn skip counting in 100's and 1000's. So skip counting in 100's means skipping 100 place. That is digit at the 10's and 1's place remain the same. For example, 7108. Now let's look at the value at 100 place. We are having 1. So after 1, what will come? 2. So next number is 7208. Next after 2, what will come? 3. So our next number is 7308. Same as next number number is 7408 now let's see skip counting in 1000 s so skip counting in 1000 s means skipping 1000 place that means digit at the hundred tens and ones place remain the same for example 2845, 3845, 4845, and 5845. What we had done here? We just changed the digit at 1000 place. That means we only changed the digit at 1000 place. 2, 3, 4 and 5. Now students, let's do the exercise 1.4. Now students, let's see the question number 1 of exercise 1.4. Here the question is, build the greatest and the smallest number with the given digits using each digit only once. Now, the first question, the number, the digits are 1, 3, 8, 2 and 1. Okay, so we have to find out the greatest number. 
so for finding greatest number first what we will do first we will see the greatest number among these four digits so the greatest number is 8 right now let's see the number after 8 is 3 the digit after 3 is 2 and the digit after 2 is 1. So this is our greatest number. Now next we have to find out the smallest number. So here the smallest number first we have to find. So the smallest number is 1 and the number after 1 is 2. And after 2 is 3. And after 3 is 8. So this is our smallest number. Okay. Now let's see. We have to find the greatest number here. Here the largest number or greatest number is. Greatest digit is 6. So we will put 6 here. And the next digit after 6 is 4. After 4, we are having 2 and after 2, we are having 0. So, this is our greatest number here. Now, let's find out the smallest number. So, here, the smallest number, for finding smallest number, first we will see the smallest number. Here, we are having 0 as the smallest, but we cannot put 0 at 1000 place because it will count as three digit number okay so we will not put zero here so the smallest the number which come after zero is two so we will put two at thousand place and zero at hundred place then after what will come four then after six so this is our smallest number now students, look at the question number second here. Skip count in 100s and complete the pattern. Here you have to skip count. That means you have to skipping 100 place numbers. Okay, so 100 place digit means digits at the tens place and ones place remains the same. So here the digit at the tens and one's place remain the same. So let's write the number. 5,200. Here 5,300. Next the number is 5,400. And these two numbers will be same. So we will write it as 87. Okay, now let's write the other number. We will change only the number at the 100 place here. Okay, so let's write after 4, what will come? 5. After 5, what will come? 6. After 6, what will come? 7. Only we will change the number at the 100 place. Right? So, this is the way to skip count in 100 S. Now, let's see the other question. Here also we have to do the same. Only we will change the digit at the 100 place. So, let's write the number. After 6, what will come? 7. And the digit at the 10s and 1s place will be same. 7, then after 7, 8 will come. Right? Then after 8, 9 will come. After 9, we will get 10. So, here we will get 70. 7094. Now, let's see the students. Question number 3. Skip count in 1000 as Skip count in 1000 and complete the pattern. Here we have to skip the counts. Here we have to skip the count in hundreds means skipping 
हंड्रेड प्लेस वो वन थाउजेंड प्लेसेस सॉरी नाउ हियर वी हैव टू स्किप द नंबर एट थाउजेंड प्लेस एंड रेस्ट ऑफ द नंबर विल बी सेम सो हियर एट थाउजेंड प्लेस वी आर हैविंग वन नाउ नेक्स्ट हियर वी आर हैविंग टू देन आफ्टर टू वट विल कम थ्री राइट एंड अदर नंबर विल बी same after 3 what will come 4 and other number will be same after 4 what will come 5 and after 5 what will come 6 okay so this is the way to skip counting in hundreds 1000s okay so let's see the other question here we have to skip the number at the thousand place only so here we are having 4 here we are having 5 and now next will be 6 okay and the value at the 100 tens and ones place will be same so we will write 999 same as here is 6 so after 6 we will get 7 after 7 we will get 8 and after 8 we will get 9 okay now students let's see question number 4 which is matching so here you have to tell the number four more than 2096 so when you add 4 to 2096 what you will get 6 plus 4 10 right 9 plus 1 10 and 1 and 2 that means 2100 So where is two thousand one hundred here? So we will write it as A. Okay. Now next one less than four thousand. So simply we have to subtract one from four thousand. This zero will become ten. This become nine. This become nine and this become three. Right. So ten minus one is Nine, 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 and here we are having three. Okay, so let's see where is this number. Here we are having this number. So B. Okay, now let's see ten less than nine nine eight nine. Ten less than that means ten less than eighty nine is ten less than eighty nine is seventy nine. So seventy nine will come here. Now next see number is one hundred more than seven thousand six hundred eighty five. One hundred more than seven hundred. Sorry, seven thousand six hundred eighty five. Okay. So let's add the numbers. More than we want more than. So we will add. When we want less than, so simply we will subtract. Okay, so here we have to add hundred. So let's add hundred. Six plus one seven seven. Now let's see where is seven seven eight five. Here we are having so D. Okay, now here we have to subtract. We have to subtract hundred. So let's subtract hundred here. Five. Seven, one minus one zero, and three. So here we are having three thousand seventy-five. Now next, one thousand more than five thousand eight hundred ninety-three. Simply just more than. When we said more than, we will add one the number. Simply we will add the number, and when we said less than. Then we will subtract the number, right? So let's add one thousand here. When we add, we will get three, nine, eight, and six. So where is six thousand eight hundred ninety three? Here. So this is F. Now let's see here. One thousand less than six thousand nine hundred forty. So at the when we have to less the number, we will subtract the number. 
सो लेट्स सब्ट्रैक्ट द नंबर जीरो फोर माइनस जीरो जीरो नाइन माइनस जीरो नाइन एंड सिक्स माइनस वन फाइव जीरो माइनस जीरो जीरो फोर माइनस जीरो फोर नाइन माइनस जीरो नाइन एंड सिक्स माइनस वन फाइव सो वेयर इज दिस नंबर नाउ द एक्सरसाइज वन पॉइंट फोर इज कंप्लीटेड रेस्ट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन इज इन होमवर्क यू हैव टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन बाई योर ओन